So hello guys, I'm going to be playing some Battlefield 4, I know this gets a little repetitive, but I definitely need to get some content out, um, I'm hoping this new camera will get here soon, so I'm just going to screw around in Battlefield for a little bit, um, just double check this all works fine, all this is good, yep, audio, should be good enough, let's get that down here, there, that works, okay. I did forget my A50s at uh, my mother's house, so I don't really have them right now. Um, so I'm kind of stuck with my Krakens. So right now we're just playing like a, a round, a match with like 12 people, or whatever, like 11 people, whatever. It's pretty empty. But I really want a full, full server overall. Um... the heck? You guys see that? I like went and sprayed that dude down. He didn't take a single hit of damage. That's kind of surprising. Sort of, I guess. I'm just spawning as a medic. Suppress a little. I was only gonna play Battlefield 3, but it's empty. I just can't believe how empty it's gotten. Ah. <laughs> this kind of sucks. I was thinking it'd be a lot more fun, but it's not really. Um, I don't know. Okay, a few people joining. Now we're in. Six to six. This one has an engine, maybe? I don't know. I have like no clue what the heck I'm doing. Just got a night vision scope one. Let me kill you. Run. Just have to be. Down there, crap, crap, crap. Move. Ah, uh, he barely got me. He barely got me right there. Hmm. somewhere <laughs> please so I have somewhere to at least spawn That'd be nice crap I can't jump up that okay okay so it's 266 so set us up to 200 should be able to do the pretty good kill I'm kind of thinking somebody might be behind me. Some people down there. Let me hit my stupid button. My sensitivity picked up. Boom. That's how we do. Alright. Bam, bam, bam. Ram it, damn, damn. You got yourself a brand new, absolutely screwed up head. Alright, pick up all the ladies. Pick up all the goats. Obviously. 
so I can see him. Uh, I'd say I could probably get that, but my mouse is like really sensitive. I need to make sure I turn on sensitivity. Love to have uh, variable zoom, variable zoom scope. Um, but just to fill you guys in while I'm kind of sitting here, or whatever, I'm gonna try and get some action. But um, I'm gonna try and fill you guys in on um, what I've been doing lately. Why videos have been kind of screwed up. Um, kind of lately, I haven't. Um, I'm kind of doing a whole bunch of different stuff. Um, I've been really looking at cameras. It's the main reason why in the past week I've been like kind of screwing your own um, uploads or whatever. <laughs> All obey. <laughs> but um, the main reason I wasn't, I haven't been able to get too many uploads out is because uh, I've been looking at cameras. I've been looking at DSLRs especially. Um, and I made a decision to go ahead and buy a um, Canon Rebel T5i. It's going to be my new main recording mic. Momo mo mo to go. Ah, you can have that. <laughs> he had a bit more of an advantage because I was like half dead. Had a five kill streak. That's pretty good. Um, but yeah, I've been looking at cameras. Cameras are definitely one of the things I've been wanting to look at. Um, the main reason being, is I want to get better quality video for my channel, especially like when it comes to reviews and such. Um, I really want to get some good quality. Um, video out to you guys um, and I really want to get into photography um, potentially even say I don't know maybe in the future I might go and start doing vlogs Expecting the dude to move her. I guess not. Cover. Let's go. like repelling I don't know what I was doing I have no clue how to go and counteract knives <laughs> I really don't it's kind of sad but I don't really have any clue this video looks kind of funky so that's a hundred I don't know huh. don't know why it's all funky looking but um, they have revealed that there will be a Battlefield 5. Hopefully it will be here by later this year. Um, it's supposed to be pretty good. I'm just really hoping that it will be really, really good. I really hope it's the next Battlefield Bad Company, practically. Because um, Bad Company was absolutely amazing. Although maybe not all people want to agree with that. It was still pretty amazing. <laughs> Just waiting to hear his footsteps. 
Alright, screw it. Run. Run, 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 run. Okay. I hear you. Somebody's trotting around. Got him. Got him. That's why I like the smaller maps. I mean, you can actually go and have a more hand on hand combat. Rather than you spawn, you pretty much get raped as soon as you spawn. It's nice to not have to worry about that. Camping, he was waiting for me. He probably heard me going up the stairs. Um, it's probably be a super long video. I am kind of tired. This is a bit later in the night. I'll try and get this video out to you guys before I fall asleep. Hopefully. <laughs> I'm Naroshkina. I think that's I think that's what they say. I'm Naroshkina. I don't know. Don't ask me. All I know is I've killed one of the enough Russians in video games, so um, yeah, I I kinda know some of the lingo, at least what it sounds like, I don't know. Full gist of everything, I have Naroshkina. Right, however you say it. Sorry for anybody who is Russian. much of any clue. Ah! He got me. He got me for the final kill. Hey, not bad. Not bad. Not a bad match. Um, gonna get into one more match. At least some of one. Gonna do this a few more minutes. Um, but I do like doing this sort of stuff. Um, gaming sometimes doesn't always sound the funnest, but usually it's pretty fun. Um, certain days, like today. I've definitely wanted to do gaming all day. So, um, but back onto the camera. I know I'm kind of skippy around, but, um, back to the camera. The camera I bought was the Canon Rebel T5i. That right there is about the best DSLR camera that you can get for around $350 for just the body. Um, with the th that's slightly used, and about, um, what is it? In about 80 or so for a lens. That's about what I paid. Um, uh, hopefully it gets here soon. I'm definitely going to do a review of some sort for it. Um, I just hope it works fine. And it looks good. Um, I'm definitely going to do some testing videos. Um, I'm going to do a 720p 60. Um, 1080p 24 and 1080p 30. Um, I'm going to try and do those. Hopefully it'll be nice and windy when I get my camera, maybe. Um, but I'm not completely certain just what the weather will be like. Kind of hoping it's going to be a bit windy. And just to um, give me some different stuff to go and record, maybe. Like moving objects and such. That's definitely one thing. Or maybe I'll just go and like record the highway or something. I just got kind of like the stock kit lens with it. Um, I did want to get the uh, next level up. I'd love to get the 18 to like 135 millimeter that they have, but it's way too expensive. They charge way too much for it. Boom! Ah, oh, you. He knew. He knew how to do that. I don't know how to do that. I gotta watch. I gotta watch how to do that. Because that's very um, helpful. If I can do that, it's kind of boring when you don't really have many people sometimes. I'm pretty much stuck one here. I think this is all this map is. It's like Conquest Small.
doing? Yeah, getting some peeps down is what I was gonna say. He barely got away from me. So I feel like I can do this for about five more minutes or whatever. Um, probably just go to bed. Um, I'm pretty tired. I haven't had too much sleep lately. Not doing so hot with sleep. Doesn't like me very much. Turns out. <laughs> I've been trying to let my natural sort of sleeping schedule kind of work. Or whatever. Thanks. That's where I miss my connect for this. Because I could just go and say, like, thank you. Um, I would go and say it. Uh, I thought I was thinking that was somebody coming around. I was going to go and get him. Shot. Maybe not. Let's go. Let's go. Sean. <laughs> Vamos, vamos. Let's go. I kind of don't make sense sometimes, but definitely Battlefield 5. I'm the main thing I'm hoping for is that the graphics will get really stepped up. I would absolutely love if they would go and use a mix between the um, CryEngine, CryEngine 4, and um, Frostbite Engine like 5 or whatever. A mix between that, you get the destruction of Frostbite and you get the beauty of. Um, of uh, whatever it is. That was a part in the campaign. Okay. I don't know where I'm going to leave going, but. Um, but if they had the CryEngine, which CryEngine 4 is pretty much about one of the most real things out there, realistic um, graphics engines out there. If you Google that, um, there's quite a few things. There's a few different examples of people who have. Um, Who have what made like little um, pictures with Crime 4, and I almost had no. There was like almost no difference between a real photo and a, like the Crime 4 stuff. Um, it is very amazing, um, truthfully. And you guys know I am a tech guy. Kill him. No. Um, but that's definitely one thing. Um, hopefully, Battlefield 5 will be a lot of fun. Um, you guys know I like Battlefield. Battlefield is awesome. Um, Black Ops 3 is pretty awesome, too. Poof. But, you know, I mean, there's a whole bunch of different things that could go right and can go wrong with Battlefield 5. I just really hope that they don't screw it up. I'm just hoping they don't have a Battlefield Hardline. I don't want that. <laughs> Battlefield Hardline is a crap game. It doesn't even earn the title of Battlefield. Battlefield has always been about war, not drugs. Um like police and stuff like that should have just been like um hardline you, you just probably could have called it hardline something like that i don't know but battlefield hardline is more of dlc it's not really built to be a separate game it's not it never probably was intended to be at least i don't think but I guess it just depends to some people. Some people love it. Some people hate it. I hate it. Um, I played the beta and I absolutely hated it. It just didn't. It just didn't have enough Battlefield feel to me. It was kind of like them trying to mix Battlefield with um, Call of Duty, 
they're never going to mix. Um, I don't think. The only way I can see them mixing is if you get a compromise between um, Battlefield and having its large maps and like Call of Duty having its um, better sort of combat statistics overall. Come on, like Black Ops 3 is amazing. I love Black Ops 3. It is definitely the best Call of Duty that's came out in a while. Um, I'm telling that truthfully. The game is pretty sweet. Um, the camping men will always be the greatest, but they definitely didn't make the suits overrated. They made it totally possible for the most part. Like everything pretty much in that game is totally possible. Advanced Warfare was the same pretty much, but still some things don't make sense at all. But I'm just really hoping the Battlefield Five is gonna be a good game. It's gonna be worth the money. Along with like Halo Five, I didn't really like it too much when I originally played it. Um, I didn't really like the multiplayer. It was too fast paced for me. Um, it because I was kind of used. To, sorry about that. I was kind of used to the ability to go and. Go make your own sort of classes and whatnot. Go and choose what you want, choose your perks and all that different stuff. It wasn't all preset. But in um, Halo 5, it is all preset. Um, I kind of didn't like that. I kind of missed that about Halo 4. I kind of got a little spoiled with that. But that there's where Halo comes from. Halo comes from like preset classes and just playing the game and enjoying it with friends. Um, definitely enjoying it with friends. I mean... It's one of the games that most, if not like almost everybody, that games today pretty much started on was the original Halo Combat Evolved. Basically, at least if you're my age, most people have already. That's how they when they started getting into gaming, like I did. Um, it was a wonderful game. I mean, like it definitely was ahead for its um, generation for its time. It was amazing. Now it's not as great, but it's pretty good. Still like to play it. Um, what else should I say? Um, but back, I guess one more thing about that camera. Um, like I said, it is a DSLR. I am going to be getting a microphone for it too, um, unless I can potentially find a way to use my Yeti. Maybe I'll either get a actual like little condenser microphone. That's um. That mounts onto the shoe or whatever on top. But if I can't, um, I'll probably go and get a lavalier. I'm thinking about a lavalier. A lavalier might be good. Um, just so I have the um, extra good um, audio, at least voice. Um, I'd like you guys to still be able to hear different stuff but it should be able to get picked up um, I'm hoping by that I'm just kind of worried that it'll pick up my breathing maybe I don't want you guys to hear me like breathing like a horse that's how I do sometimes it's really getting into stuff going to capture this flag and I might be able to get this match over I just know I'm tired I'm like pretty freaking tired. Um, although it is only like 9:30 at night, um, I'm tired. Uh, it's 9:40, actually. But I hope you guys did like the um, Blue Yeti review. Um, actually, that was the first video that I've ever edited with um, Sony Vegas. It worked amazingly for the most part. The only thing that I have a complaint to Sony about would be the fact that they, it's not really a super big thing with Sony, it's more or less just kind of the compatibility types. Um, so like when I was trying to upload the video or whatever for my iPhone, I put it on the computer, copied it down, all that, um, it runs fine, all that, I'm going to try and put it into Photoshop, well not Photoshop, um, Vegas Pro. And it doesn't want to work. It didn't work. Um, I 
I'm not really sure why. I think it just might have been because the codecs weren't updated yet. Also, when I put the video in there and tried to um, put it in there, I think it when it looked online, updated itself and added that. I'm not certain. Don't quote me on that because I have no clue how it added it. Well, I got to edit the video. Um, maybe it's just because QuickTime wanted to work properly. <clears throat> but, you know. At least I got the video. Um, because I went, I recorded the audio for that video with the Blue Yeti itself. All the audio for that is from the Blue Yeti. Um, shotgun. Um, but, um, the video is obviously recorded on my iPhone 6S Plus. I'm going to do a 6S Plus review when I get this camera. So look out for that. Um, it's definitely very nice of a phone. I recommend it. Um, if you're in the market for a new phone and you want something pretty large sized if you want something large like the iPhone 6s like the plus the plus is pretty nicely sized um, yeah there's some phones from like Android yes they can do 1440p I owned one of the Android 1440p OLED phones my Galaxy Note 4 that I used to have was one um, it wasn't a bad phone but I have to say that it wasn't very, um, it will, uh, how do I say it? It will not be, um, as good for as long as what an iPhone can do. Um, like this 6S Plus can probably, if I really wanted to, I could probably bear down with it for about two to three years, and that's basically set up for a reason with like the android you can be lucky to get about a year out of them to maybe two years depending like my note 4 it went kind of crapped out after about a year not sure why but it did because i took amazing care of it i never dropped it i dropped it once um and that was about it i gotta replace it and then the new one went and did the same things so i mean they want to interface with my wi-fi and all that I'm pretty sure it was probably a glitch with um, Android um, Vanilla or whatever it is, the Android stuff or something. Something with Android probably. Um, so I'm just gonna like end it um, as soon as this match is over, I guess. So thank you guys for watching, and I guess I'll see you soon enough um hopefully i'll get another video out tomorrow so um thank you guys i guess for watching i do hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day i hope i helped you guys enjoy your day um don't forget to check my bio i do have my social stuff my social links in there for like twitter instagram twitter instagram and google obviously um, are all in my bio, it's all with um, computer specs and such, if you want to get like what my computer runs. So, um, yeah, I guess I'll leave this here for you guys, so thank you for watching, and enjoy the rest of your day, I guess. See you later.